Don't mind me, gentlemen. I just came in for an ice cold drink. You lost? Cause I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for a woman. Not give her cash. You wouldn't be the first. Selena Kyle, I'm told she practically lives here. <laughs> Selena, huh? You don't strike me as her type. You'd be surprised. Hey. Don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. The cops take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> Are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Nice to meet you. Uh, Frank. Yeah. Funny seeing you here. So much in the papers. Whole other thing, meeting the man in real life. You're uh, shorter than I thought you would be. Leave him alone, Frank. The camera asked a few pounds. trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. Nice lad. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. Well, I've met a couple of his goons myself. Your client isn't one for subtlety. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. The Penguin. <laughs> penguin can't take on both of us, and I'm not going anywhere. Clearly you know something about him. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. If Penguin is everything you say, there's no tree high enough for you to climb. He will find you. So what are you suggesting? The bat helps the cat? And the cat helps the bat. Bruce, sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us, working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. He doesn't need to know about this. Keep Harvey out of this. The less he knows, the safer he'll be. I'm sure his safety is your paramount concern. You and I... Yep, there she is. Well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle? Penguin says, hello. Beat it. We're here for her. If you care about your own skin, you'll get the hell out. I said, leave! Making me. Mm-mm-mm. 
Nope. Where should I throw you today? Uh, the pool table is fine. Okay. First, you're doing business with you. Not done yet. Let's give it to him. I just don't know where to quit, huh? Wrong button. Yeah! You buffoon. Good for such a pretty boy. Oh, come on, this way. Yes. Go for it. Ah, uh, uh, Bruce, you don't get to say this kitty cat yet. I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. When will you give me the opportunity to smash? When will I see you again? <sighs> when you least expect it. So I'll take you that as a yes. Me, you know. I get the smash. <laughs> yeah. She said yes. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check I'm gonna to see pound that kitten. Phone we can use. Processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here, all from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice. People look up to Batman after how you handled Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. 
visiting as Bruce is a much harder battle. Going as the bats. We'll make him wet his pants. He won't know what hit him. What will hit him? By the time we're done with him, he's gonna be thinking as a dream. Thank me later if Hill tells me Penguin's plans. Deborah, you incompetent! Dent's up in the polls. I need to crucify him in the debate or we can kiss re election and your job goodbye. You'd better be back here in the next 15 minutes or I'm cutting your pay. Deborah! Mm -mm -mm. It's not Deborah. Deborah! Is that you? It's the Batman. You know who I am. It's time we finally met. Batman? What are you doing here? You know who Penguin is. So I've heard of him. So what? I've got nothing to do with that lowlife. Do you hear me? You think people will still vote for you when you've got no teeth left? Yeah. yeah! I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Wayne, there's the real problem. He's the one you should be after. Every fiber of his being built on lies, his status, his fortune. He should be held accountable. What does Penguin want with Bruce Wayne? The atrocities that occurred at the hands of his father. He only wants to expose the Waynes for the criminals that they are. <gasps> Security! Now that's not a very smart Pick idea. Up, damn it! Security! I'm be. <laughs> Don't kill me! I've done nothing wrong! Why come to you? Because I knew about Arkham Asylum and what was done to those poor people. Penguin wants revenge for what happened to his mother. Thomas Wayne sent her to Arkham, along with who knows how many other innocents. Nothing was wrong with any of them. Until Thomas locked them up. Something this big couldn't have been hidden. There'd be records. <sighs> with enough money, you can make anything or anyone disappear. <gasps> I didn't dare speak up. Whatever happened in the past, it's nothing compared to what's happening now. Penguin isn't the only child of ours. There are others whose families were destroyed by Wayne. They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. <laughs> no. Please. Don't. <laughs> you deserve whatever's coming for you. If I hadn't given Penguin what he wanted, he would have struck at the debate tonight. I didn't just do this for myself. I'm trying to protect Gotham. Finally. About damn time. It's Batman! Shoot him! Come on, get the mayor out of here! Not tonight, boys. I heard everything, Master Bruce. What he said about your father. It must be difficult to process. I need to know what went on in Arkham Asylum. Uh, indeed. I'm just as frustrated as you are. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. Yeah. <sighs> 
I wonder what else is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. But... Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Thanks for the heads up. Good. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now more than ever. I'll, uh, leave you to it then. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff and making ad buys. A Dent spokesperson said these rumors are nothing more than a smear tactic perpetuated by the incumbent Mayor Hill's campaign. In other news, nobody goes to Gotham's dive bars expecting a quiet night out, but police say a brawl tonight at the Stack Deck Bar in Otisburg was the rowdiest one in recent memory. Reports say multiple arrests were made, with all the suspects taken into custody while unconscious. Police are seeking an unidentified man and woman who were seen in conversation with the assailants shortly before the fight. Hey, that's us. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path. Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now.